Hey, welcome to Tech Tips with Solo Media. I'm Amanda. And I am Linus. And today we actually have something that we haven't tried yet. It's one of those suction cup thingies that holds the camera to your Super car. Super cool. And this is by Leo Photo, and it's called the SC02. Mm -hmm. And we the actually kit. have the kit. Yeah. yeah. So it comes with a little magic arm. And just while I have this right here, so the, the actual suction cup can hold a max payload of 40 kilograms but it recommends that you only use 1.5 kilograms on the specs on the website. <laughs> but so you can. <laughs> maximum 40 kilos, but you better stick closer to 1.5, yep. according to the website. And the little magic arm, the little adjustable arm that comes with it has a max payload of two kilos. Mm. The thing itself weighs 200 grams and the little magic arm weighs yeah. 84 grams. Yeah. I've looked a little bit and it's a small kit now, yeah? It's for a DSLR, yeah. it's nothing it's crazy. No, no it's not. But for if, a phone even. Right, but you can actually get a couple of them and okay. link them together and That's put something good. more That's beefy good. on there. I plan on testing a couple of these because a small rig has one, mm, I was just say, has one. The magic arm part looks a lot like the, ma uh, yeah. the, ma um, yeah, the exactly. magic part that I have from small rig. That you've seen. Yeah, exactly. Use. Yeah, exactly. So it looks very similar to and, that. and this one also has a phone holder. So if you want to just go with the least payload of 0.5 grams. Well, I think that would be perfect. You can just put your iPhone on that thing. Uh, now, um, here's your manual. Super mm -hmm. thin. And you get a little Allen key in it. I love the case that it comes in because it reminds me Ooh, of my lens case. The lens case, yeah. Yeah. Look at that. Nice Leo photo, right? I like some Leo leather. photo. I'm not going to lie. They make some quality stuff. All right, All right, so this is the actual device. Super cool. And I'm going to tell you right from the get-go, when it came in the mail, I stuck it on our window at home yeah. instantly, took it out of the box instantly. <laughs> but the first time I tried to stick it on, I didn't look at any instructions like oh, normal. Not. And I tried to, oh, but it has a thing. And then once I actually put it on, it'll stick to many, many different surfaces. So what you do is you do you do it until the little gray part is gone. It's not visible anymore. And then if you can see yeah. any gray, that then means there's air in there. Your phone could go away. But look. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. And then Jake and I couldn't get the release <laughs> from oh, the no. window. Yeah. How do you so do you, it? you actually push no no no, you don't do that. No. That you <laughs> you're worse than I am with not reading the instructions. There, see, you push the well, two. I just saw it being pushed when you did that. I thought you were yeah. done. So one more time. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Got this on the tight shot there, Jake. And you push in. We tried pushing oh, yeah. down at first. Oh, okay. So we were like, oh no, we're going to break our window. We're not going to get our, what do you call it? A uh, deposit pack. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, super easy. What, what do you think? Yeah, let me look at it. That's really cool. Isn't it cool? That's good suction yeah. too. And see, it's got like a little filter there that, mm -hmm. that helps suck the air For in. The, yeah, it, perfect. Yeah. Really good. It's a nice little design actually. <clears throat> and I can say this looks way better and stronger than I thought it would. Yeah, it's not this flimsy This is bigger than I thought. It's not yeah. flimsy at all. And retail price, like... retail bark price is about 80 bucks. Mm -hmm. That's a good price. 80 bucks US, yeah. That's a good price. Exactly. So, yeah. I feel like I would be okay with putting my phone or my, my camera on there. Well, here's what I'm going to do. We have at least one old Canon 70D still sitting that around in the do. office here somewhere. You can get those pretty much for 50 bucks <laughs> <laughs> on, <laughs> on, on the and they're, eBay. They're a bit and stuff. heavy too. And they're a bit heavy. So we're going to stick <laughs> a 70D nice. on here. Yeah. All right, to the field or to the car. Okay guys, so we have the Leo Photo suction cup here attached with the little magic arm it came with yeah. to my old 7D. I love this camera, but it's the cheapest thing I got. Yeah. <laughs> I kind of think, no, just to be straight out honest, this is a test for us. I don't want to use one of the brand new cameras, but it would be better with one of them because this has no stabilization of whatsoever. Course. So you I'm understand. not I'm not super hopeful for the footage. This is clearly a weight test. Yeah. So what we did, our, uh, our uh, what do you call him in English, our uh, building manager, sure. uh, yeah. actually had the idea of attaching keychain rings to the uh, 70, and then we got some nice lashing straps. Yeah. So we're going to, just for security's sake, have it in the window. The last thing I want is for this to fly off the car and... <laughs> Drive sm over it. Or smash the windshield of the car. But that's why you should have insurance and security. So, just for... Should we 
or is the cover off? Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. I do this all the time. Cover off. Thank you, Linus. So we're gonna stick this bad boy right here and pump it. Pump, 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 pump. pump. There you go. All right. Now I got a longer rope. You see, no, no gray is showing. That means there's no air. Right, and you want to make sure that that's on pretty good. But Linus, if you go to the other side of the car, I'll throw this over to you. I, okay. And we're gonna secure this into his window. There you go. You want both ends of it. And I know. I just what, didn't want to. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna jam it in the door and hold on to it once okay. we get going. All right. So we'll see you once we get driving. In the next one. All right. <laughs> Yeah. Yep. Oh, that worked out pretty good. Yeah. So now we're going to try to stick it to the side of my door here. All right. Let's, let's do go. it. Yeah. Yeah. So now we make sure that we have no gray here. There you go. All right. Turn yeah. it so that it's the right uh, way. That's it's, fine. Yeah. I, I, okay. want, I want to see it forward. So okay. Like that. Sure. Yeah. And you got this. All right. I got this. And I'm going to strap this in here. And this time I'm going to leave it open so I can press record once we get going. Oh, nice. Yeah. Let's go. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Whee! Yahoo! It's holding up pretty good. You're not holding it tight, right? No, I'm not holding no, it tight. Good. No, So we're actually testing No, it. exactly. I'm just holding it just That's as a precaution. Yeah. And, and again, it has an iPhone attachment with it as well, so. Oh yeah. Yeah, so we could do this with the phone. Technically, maybe we should try that too. We almost should try that. We're gonna try it. Woo! Woo! All right. That worked awesome, actually. I think so. It might even be usable even without the IBIS, but again, I would have no problem putting an R5 or something on this. It actually holds up really solid. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go get the iPhone attachment and actually stick this inside the car and go for a little drive. Yeah. All right, let's, let's go. What we want to do? Why do we? There's your camera. I got your camera now, Linus. Yeah. There we go. And we'll go ultra wide so you see me and Caleb yes. in the background. Hi, Caleb. Sup, dude. All right. Caleb is right, our camera nice. dude for there the day. Go. There we go. All right, nothing more for us to do but get in and press record. All right, I'm recording on Linus's phone here. And in we go. All right. All right, so, so far I'm actually super impressed with this thing. It's working really well. It's really working well. That's... I mean, overall, for, for what this costs, this whole thing cost 80 bucks in total. Yeah. And I mean, you're getting so much power out of it. Like this was able to hold a full DSLR. 7D with a lens on. Yeah, and yeah. the 7D isn't light. It's it's actually been one of the weatherproof old school bodies of, yeah. of Canon, heavier than a mirrorless camera by far. Absolutely. Right? Yeah. So I, again, I would have no problem putting an R6 or an R5 on this thing. Um, I do think that you should always have, because again. The backup. You should, because you have, you have the obligation anything you put on your car needs to be thoroughly secured to your car so uh, even though the the suction cups could probably hold with no problem yeah. on any of these systems but especially this this leo photo one's great you have the obligation as a driver to make sure that everything's tied down otherwise if that camera flies off and smashes somebody's window it's, it's, your fault. it's all on yeah. you yeah. so yeah just a little bit of advice overall love this product yeah, it does really come cool. in a smaller version that's more for action cameras yeah. and iPhones. Yeah. Uh, I think that's the SC01. This is the SC02. Um, but yeah, I give it a thumbs up. I'm super impressed and I can't wait actually to use this in future videos. I think we might have more of these things that we do right now. Right, exactly. Okay guys, well, like and subscribe. Yeah, don't forget to comment if you have any questions. Yeah, exactly. And we'll see you in the next one. Wave bye, Kate.